It's me Ryan here and today we're going to talk about a topic which is do you really need triple monitor setups or dual monitor setups or just a single monitor? We're going to jump into whether how this different type of setups help to improve your productivity and maybe what use cases would you need this type of setups for. So with that, let's jump right in to today's video. Let's go. There are three kinds of monitor setups out there. First, which is a traditional one monitor setup then the somewhat common dual monitor setups and then well the more exotic one which is the three monitor setups so generally with that, i'm not going to dive into like those really exotic ones which are like four to five or six monitor setups as well those are not really very common today and for monitor wise i'm not really going to look at ultra wides as well those are for another video i'm going to base most of this video on 24 and 27 inch monitors so you can mix and match these or you can just have triple or double 27 inch or 24 inch monitors so with that let's jump into the first one which is a single monitor setup let's go for the users of traditional single monitor setups it's mostly for office work with like word in the background and like just for generic users it's the most cost effective setup as most computers already has one video output so you don't really need to buy a graphics card for this and well you only need one monitor so that's only a cost for one. The space wise, it leaves a very small footprint as you only need one monitor, you can just place it anywhere basically and it won't take up as much space compared to two or three you set up. If I were to give this setup a rating, I will say for productivity, it's about a 4 out of 10, space wise, it's about a 10 out of 10, and for affordability, it's also 10 out of 10. Next, we have the dual monitor setups. These will be targeted towards traditional users or so, like office users who maybe refer to more than one document at one time and maybe those people who want to do video editing or so just have better multitasking. I would say that this is the most common setup other than the single monitor setup as it has a good balance between cost, space and usability. Okay, why do I say it's affordable? Because you can generally buy two of the same type of monitors for below $400 if you're not looking for a gaming one that have 144Hz refresh rate. I'll link a decent pair of monitors that are good for like this style of dual monitor setups which is aka the Dell SE2419HR that I reviewed a while back. Link for that will be in the description down below. And from my personal experience having come from a single monitor back in 2014, it had allowed me to well do a lot of things more efficiently the method that is it schoolwork or just being able to edit better or just referring to you know media consumption such as writing a script and referring to the specifications of a certain product. Rating wise, I'll give this a 9 out of 10 for productivity and space wise 8 out of 10 as well this setup does have a bit of a bigger footprint and affordability wise I'll say it's an 8 out of 10 as well you have to buy two monitors. And lastly is the triple monitor setup. It's not a very common setup I'll say compared to dual or single and it targets only a few certain groups of people. Why did I say that it's targeted towards a few groups of people? Well, as an editor myself, I feel that having the third monitor really helps a lot in terms of spreading out my assets and making assets at the same time. You just have to do Lightroom, Photoshop, or maybe some uh, inside stuff for my assets in the videos. There's definitely another use which is definitely for gaming as it gives you more immersive view as all three monitors does take up more of your peripheral vision. Rating wise, I'll give this a 10 out of 10 for productivity and a 5 out of 10 for space as well. You do need a big dash space for 3 different monitors or 3 of the same type of monitors. And affordability, well, it's quite explanatory because you have to buy 3 monitors and preferably you'll want to buy the 3 of the same type of monitors. So they're quite a bit of cash monies. Overall, not all of us would need a triple monitor setup or a dual monitor setup. It really depends on your use case. And well, if you say you think you need a triple monitor setup, there's definitely a lot of screen real estate for you to use. And well, definitely you can use all of it depending on your workload. So with that, we have come to the end of the video. If you guys liked it, leave a like, subscribe, share a comment down below. And I guess I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.